Tidied up by Levitt for Laird. Referee plays advantage here. Mason Greenwood looks to take advantage and does. Well played by the referee. Well finished by Mason Greenwood. And it hasn't taken Manchester United long to get into their stride. Four minutes on the board. They lead 1-0. Powerful run from Laird there, created that. And you're right, the referee was going to blow for a foul. Just got impeded in the end, but fortunately it's fell nicely for Greenwood, takes a touch, doesn't hit it particularly great, but the main thing is it's in the corner, across the keeper, and off the post, 1-0 up. See Blackburn are quite happy to drop off and let United have the ball. Greenwood picks the pocket of Wilson, saw the keeper off his line, it's a delightful finish. Something out of nothing from Mason Greenwood. And Manchester United are two to the good with 20 minutes on the board. You know, the skipper of Wilson will be disappointed with his touch there. He's got to be aware that there's a player coming in to try and rob him of the ball. Tries to control it, just knocks it into Greenwood's path, but then still got a bit of work to do, Dave. He's assessed where the keeper is, way out his box. Had a little look, dinked it over him, executed well. He's away again here, looking lively and going for goal and getting one. Well, that will frustrate Manchester United hugely because it's been such a comfortable first half, but Jack Vale has kept going and going for Blackburn and gets his reward. That's a one that United uh, didn't want to get, but they've got it, and it'll give Blackburn a little bit of impetus now going into the half-time team talk. It's a problem for United, it's a real problem. It's a second Blackburn goal, and Jack Vale's got them both. And from a really comfortable position, Manchester United all of a sudden find themselves level. Well, you shouldn't score a goal really side-footing it in, Dave, into your box. Somebody's got to go and meet that and take responsibility. We've got enough lads that are big enough there to deal with that. Out comes Winterbottom, gets a hand to it. And it's Jalil Sadu who completes the clearance to Jack Vale. Well, this could be a problem. Ethan Laird picks the Blackburn pocket, and Antony Langer says thank you very much indeed. Having worked so hard to get back on terms, Blackburn Rovers gift Manchester United the lead back. Well, Laird's done well, still up there from the uh, from the corner. He's chased it down, ran 20, 30 yards, put a great challenge in, nicked it, and put it on a plate for Langer, who still had to beat the keeper at the near post. Could have swiped it that with his left, but it lets it run across his body, side foots it in with his right. That's a, a back pass which was played blind and could be picked up here by Sam Burns. And it's found a way through and Blackburn have found a way back again in this crazy game. Well, he's pounced on the pass back from Galbraith, didn't hit it with enough pace on it. Even then, the keeper can still get you out of trouble. But Fortichek looked as if he'd saved that one and just a disaster for him, really. It's happened to goalkeepers in the past. It'll happen again. In the future, it's just one of them you've just got to say, forget it. Greenwood. Still going. And still. And still. That's had a seal a hat trick. And quite possibly the game, too. Mason Greenwood has three and might well have finally seen off Blackburn Rovers. Created that goal out of nothing, really, didn't he? He's got it in the inside, sort of left channel there, a wide left, cut inside. I think the Blackburn defenders know he can go either way. Cuts inside on his right, looks like he's going to maybe do something, step over, opens up the goals, fires it past the keeper. Winterbottom, who just says made some great saves, had no chance with that at all. Would have beat most keepers, flies into the top corner. 